perimeter and get looking. I don't want any of that. Don't I? Doggy fiancé can make that jump. We'll have to find a way to shrink the gap for us. Right. I'll think of something. Just keep everyone together, Freebie. like one of Gingerveer's memoir boxes.
not how it ends. get back to the house. What? No, Mila. We have to get out of here. Come with us. No. We have to go back for Papa and Bolo. They're still inside the ship. I saw Bolo escape the house with me. But then he disappeared. I don't know where Papa is. Liam, we can't stay here. The rats are all around us. It's too risky, Mila. We'll find Bolo and your father, but we need to get ourselves to safety first. You know this slough. Come with us. My family? We have to go back for them. If Milo were harmed or captured, Liam could never forgive himself. Not after all Valo had done for him and his friends. But the Stoatling was both determined and desperate. Liam would need to find a way to convince Mila that things would work out best by fleeing first into the slough with them. I'm going back with or without you. I have to help Papa and Bolo. There's nothing we can do for them right now, but hope for the best. How can you say that? I can't abandon my family. How can I know they'll be okay if I don't go help? I've lost everything. I can't lose them too. We're here to help you, Mila. Just trust us. How is trust going to help anything? You don't get it. Our family is all we have. You're right. I don't get it. I have all the scouts and, and the whole village that have my back. But all that's taught me is that it's important to put your trust in others. So trust us. Please. My father did say he trusts you. What can I possibly do with you that I can't do by going back myself? Right now, we're all afraid. We aren't thinking clearly, and, and Sophia can barely stand. Rush plans are careless plans. I know this now. We must find someplace safe to regroup. Mila, I know you want to go back for your family, but doing so is reckless. I promise you, I will do everything I can to repay my debt to your father. And right now, that's keeping you safe. Please, come with us. If I do... You'll help me find Papa and Bolo as soon as we can, right? Yes, I swear it. Okay, I'll follow you, Liam.
sort of alternate ending? Here is way too thick. I'm not sure what I was expecting. This raft is the only way forward. Oh, bird. I don't like water. Oh, you want to stay here with the snake, do you? Come on, everyone in. that? I hear what? What are you on about? This way. Someone said my name. Do you have any idea where we're going? I'm trying. This raft is the only way forward. Oh, bird. I don't like water. Oh, you want to stay here with the snake, do you? Come on, everyone in. that? I hear what? What are you on about? This way. Someone said my name. Do you have any idea where we're going? I'm trying.
This way. The rats are over there. Trust me. Theater. What? Oh, it's the snake. Look. Oh, I... You all really don't hear that. Oh, we hear it all right. It's hissing like a maniac. We have to go back. Look, everyone. It's just a snake skin. I can't believe you almost drove us straight into a snake, Liam. Mr. Liam? How did we know it was safe? Mouse! There was a mouse in the swamp. What is mouse? I say, there might not be a snake, young mouselings, but it belonged to one. And I don't recommend waiting for him to come find you. Never mind. All of you, come with me. We'd best make haste to safety. There's dangerous folk afoot tonight. Wait, were you the one leading us out of the slough all this time? Certainly not. I just saw you now emerging from the fog. But if it wasn't you... Liam, you, you don't think it was... Come, good beast. Follow me. His name was Captain Jeb Starthistle, and he was perhaps the most refined mouse Sophia had ever met, despite living in a swamp. Is this your, um, house? You'll stay with me for the night, of course. 
By then, Asmodeus should have had his fill and be settled down for a day of digestion. <laughs> and I must say, it's rather cheery to have visitors. Mila, perhaps you can help me prepare. Mila? What have you got there, you rapscallion? It's... I... I need it for studying. My dear, please do not tell me you've gone and stolen another heart. It's important, Uncle Jeb. It took me forever to get. Uh, very well, Mila, I won't take it from you, but you cannot keep it inside the house. Put it outside, under the porch. Uh... Do she really be having a... Uh, maybe better not to ask, Limber. Now, on to Redwall, are you? Redwall may be northeast of here, but you do best to head due north through Grating Gully. On the other side, there's a secret route that will surely cut your travel time drastically. A uh, shortcut? The Old Otter's Den. It's a tunnel that cuts under the mountain. The only problem is that it requires a special key to open. Wait, a special key? Freebie, you don't think he's referring to the Tangram? I, I suspect it just might. Certainly worth a shot. Well then, I suppose we're off to the Otter's Den. So the noble scouts, with Captain Jeb's help, plotted their route to Redwall. But with the moon already high in the sky, it wasn't long before they were struggling to keep their eyes open. You can't sleep, Mila? No. I can still smell it in my nose. Smell what? The smoke. From our home. Oh. I'm so sorry, Mila. When we escaped, Bolo told me to flee into the bog. But I don't know what happened to him after I started running. And what about Papa? I, I should have gone back for them. Your pa and Bolo are both strong, capable stoats. I'd bet a wheel of cheddar they're together right now, heading our way. You think so? I do. Now, you should be shutting your eyes. You don't want to be grumpy when you see them again in the morning. Hello, my flower. Vallo, I'm so pleased to see you. Is everything all right? Jeb, thank you for harboring my daughter and our friends last night. <sighs> I'm afraid I must ask you to keep Mila a bit longer. What's wrong, Vallo? Bolo has been kidnapped by that wretched cheese thief and his rats. I'm gonna follow them north and bring Bolo back. We'll come with you, Valo. We'll help rescue Bolo from Cheese Thief. I can't ask you to do that, Scouts. You saved our lives. This is all we can do to begin to repay you. Besides, we're heading north anyway, to the Otter's Den. Yeah, and I can help. No, Mila. You're staying here with Jeb. But I'm strong and capable too. Just like you are. Mila. If you don't let me help my brother, I'll just sneak out and do it myself. You know I've done it before. Don't leave me behind, Papa. <sighs> all right. All right. We'll all go. Good. Brilliant. Then let's get moving. Whenever you're ready, we can take the raft across the slough to Great and Gully. For now, take a moment to rest and convene with your friends. I'd better check up on everyone.